Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a get ready with me for Christmas Eve. <laughs> Disclaimer again, if I look over there, I'm using my back camera, not my front camera. I haven't used primer in so long, but let's go for it, I guess. I used the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer. I feel pretty weird about already going into the new year because this year flew by like um, it doesn't really feel like christmas it literally just feels like another day which is kind of how i've been feeling lately but i don't know this is the milani conceal and perfect two-in-one foundation and concealer in the shape 07 sand i don't know if you could catch that i'm gonna use the elf powder blurring brush as a foundation brush and I just go in in circular motions um I don't really like putting makeup on my nose because I get pretty oily on my nose sometimes and it just swipes off which can be really annoying but it is what it is I really like this foundation concealer thing. It's like, I feel like the perfect coverage. Is it just me? I swear it cannot just be me, but I hate forehead makeup so much. It's like, ugh, I don't know. It just doesn't hit the same feeling on your cheeks, in my opinion. And my hair's a mess. Because I haven't even brushed it since I showered. And this is the Real Techniques, the Bake, the, the Bake Beauty Blender, I don't know its name. I think it's for your body or something. And, and then I just pat off kind of the axis. I don't know if people talk about and get ready with me. Um, I feel like they're more so a thing that people with like fake fan bases do. Yeah, but I want to try to start this whole on thing. You know, it's just that whole thing where like, the whole everyone's scared of getting bullied from their um like mates in high school i don't know high schoolers are really mean i'm just gonna leave it at that really mean <laughs> um but i've slowly been learning to not put my time and energy into people like that because if you are a real friend to someone you do not care what they do as long as it makes them happy to support them and yeah my friends are supportive i think and if not i don't care because this is a journey for me to decide if i like or not and not them you know what i mean um so now i'm just wiping off <laughs> i'm sorry i'm wiping off the foundation thing off my lips so I can apply some chapstick. Um, I'm using the Aquaphor Lip Repair. I love this thing. I've had it for a while. You guys can look color on me. Okay. And I have to shut my eyebrows. <sighs> okay, I don't know how, but I'm going to need to find a way to blur this part out. Or just don't do this at home. We'll leave it at that. But, yeah. They're fake scissors. Um, my eyebrows are going to give me problems today. I just know it. I'm feeling it in my bones. Oh, okay, whatever. We're just going to leave it. Because then I get frustrated and I take all of my makeup off. And it's not that kind of day. Lately, I've been seeing people set their eyebrows with powder, so that's what we're gonna do. I just used the top of this powder, like what's in the cap, and this is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus in the shade Banana. You can't see, but the only reason I'm not gonna recommend this powder is because it has talc, which I believe can cause cancer, if I'm not wrong. But, yeah, so, 
As soon as I finish this powder, I'm going to go ahead and find a different one to use. And then I just blend the top because when I'm scraping with the scissors, it kind of picks up the powder that's at the top. So yeah, I'm going to go pat it down. I put a little bit more under my eye, on my eye box. I almost said under my eye box. Now I'm going with my Real Techniques, the Little Beauty Blender, the normal size one. And I'm just going to blend that under my eye. Just like this. And kind of blend up into this part of my nose. I don't know if you see, like right here. So... So, for this, you have to be pretty quick. At least, I would think so. So, you just pat it really quick. While you're doing this eye, really quick, really, 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 really quick. And then you grab more powder, put it on here, and then you're going to brush this one out, because I've noticed this powder kind of creases. Today, we're not putting on lashes. Also, um, I feel kind of sad because my brother's moving out on New Year's with his girlfriend and their kid and I'm kind of sad because their kid was like my best friend um, this I wish I could tell you the name of this I think it's an elf curling iron curling wand lash curler yeah, I think it's a la elf one it's like the cheapest one that you can get at the drugstore, to be honest. Now I'm going with my CoverGirl Lash Blast Clean Hydrofuge. It's waterproof mascara. Right there, it says waterproof. Just putting it on the ends so they're not as heavy in the bottom. Then with my lower lashes, I do the same. That's good enough. Um, so now I'm going... All the way out here. It's in the shade I met someone. Just try to draw a nice straight and curved line. And I blend it. Very right now. And then going in with the same brush that I use for my powder, I use it for my highlight. And I just take off all the powder very quickly. I just go into the corner right there. Just put some on my nose and blend. This is also an Eco Tools brush. These are both Eco Tools brushes. Again, I don't know their name. I'm sorry, I've had them for a little over a year, but they started doing really good. And the names just wear off on these. I don't know why. But you can get them at Walgreens. Every time I go, I see them. I don't usually put highlight on the eyebrow right here i used to but i don't know why i stopped i used to kind of more so do it when i put on lashes but i don't really wear lashes that often anymore my lashes have really grown a lot in the just the, like two months that i stopped regularly wearing lashes they grew a lot so i'm really liking my lash brush then you go in with your Milani Make It Last setting spray. My wrist pops. I look dumb. Anyways, um, I have to do my lips still. And then I kind of recurl my lashes depending if they fall or not. Sometimes. And I'm plucking some hairs so now i go in with wet and wild cold crayon um, 
I don't know if you can hear the background noise. If you can, I'm sorry. It is my brother. I just do like this. This is, it doesn't have a name. All I know it was in a birthday present with more and they have lip glosses, I think. And it's Paris Hilton. That's all I know. And I just take off the inner part. So it actually looks kind of like a lip liner. Oh, I need to like curl my lashes. I'm probably only going to straighten my curtain lines because I hate how their shape is. I don't know if that makes sense, but their shape is very annoying. So let's move on to my hair. I got this at, I think, Marshall's. I'm pretty sure. But yeah. And now it is time to just straighten my bangs. And I just grab my bangs and I just straighten them out to the top. Carefully. And you are done. Thank you so much. If you stayed to the end, I'm very grateful for you. And I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed filming it for you. And I'll see you guys in my next video.